I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars, Cancer. Now, the full moon is in your sign this week um, on the night, so the start of the week. Now, of course, your ruled your ruler is the moon, so anything to do with the moon um, at any time when there's a full moon, a new moon, or um, you know any uh, intense moon activity will affect you no matter where it is in the in the zodiac um, on its journey but right now this week it's in your sign so um, I want to say to some of you take cover <laughs> you know um, I have my moon is in cancer and I was born on a full moon and I'm tell you it really affects me every time there's a full moon I don't even like to really go out on a full moon which I know is a bit extreme but anyway um, so what you do need, a few things here, what you do need to do is just be careful. Okay, don't take any risks. If you're driving, don't try to, you know, run that red light. Even if you're walking across the road, don't try to beat the cars. So, you know, just take a step back. Um, don't take any gambles or risks with anything in your life, okay? Now, the other thing a full moon can do is like it, it acts as the energy to help you um, bring things to a closure and move on. If anything's not really working in your life, then the full moon can, the energy of the full moon can really just break it apart and disintegrate it so you're able to then build it up. If it is working, then the then the energy can just make it more intense. So um, the message there is to, uh, if something is destined to leave your life, Cancer, then, you know, let it go. Don't, you know, don't hold on too tightly. Also, you know, when people, things or situations leave our lives, it's, it's not for always for a bad reason. It can just simply mean that you're moving on your journey and you're parting company. You're going different. You're walking different paths. Nothing else. Okay. Um, now the other movement this week is is Venus, the planet of love and possessions, um, moves into your. Let me see. It moves into your solar ninth house on the 14th, the end of the week. So. Um, this all takes in um, traveling. You know, some of you could be, you know, planning a trip. It also is a position where you can just think more deeply about, you know, the person you are, the person you want to be, and how you move forward in this point to get to that point. Okay. Have a great week, Cancer. Good week for you. Great year coming up. And I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye for now.